Hello everyone, thanks so much for dropping by. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Rosie and I do videos on planners and purses. So if those things are of interest to you, make sure to click the subscribe button so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. And if you're returning, welcome back. I'm so happy you're here again. This video is a comparison of Motrim's Crim Croc and White Lychee Planners. So let's get this video started. I've just been super excited to do this video. I always get asked so many questions on the difference between the cream croc and the white lychee. And hopefully after watching this video, you can get a good understanding of what the color differences are. I'm just going to start out with um, the cream croc first. So even though they are both cream crocs, you can kind of see a bit of different colorings. Major reason for this is because of the shadowing and there's just more surface area for that shadowing to occur. So it might seem to you that the personal is a tad bit darker than the pocket. I got this from their first batch of the cream croc while this personal um, I got a few months ago. So I think it was like shortly after Christmas of 2020. So at the beginning of 2021 and you can kind of see that it is a bit darker. What I do think is if you took acetone to it, which many people have been doing to get rid of the shadowing, it does become more bright and it would be more like this white lychee color. The shadowing kind of looks like the original white lychee batch. The shadowing kind of matches this. So how to best describe it? It's as if these two were together to create the cream crocs. So that's pretty much what the cream crocs look like. Now let's go to the white lychees. The white lychees are definitely different. You can see here that the white lychee in personal ring size is a tad bit darker than this white lychee, which is my Hobonichi Weeks cover. And this is the newer batch. This Hobonichi Weeks is the newer model with the big back pocket and the foam in it. I just spilled coffee on here, don't, don't mind me. Um, <laughs> And this one here is probably one of their first batches. Um, not the very first, but one of the original batches of white light sheets. So it's a bit of an off-white color. This darker shadowing is a great color match to what color this white light she is. So you can see that. And these are the different variations. There's more coffee on that of um, them together. And so... These are the white lychees. You can see that together. Hopefully you can see it. I'm just going to move it around so you guys can see what they look like. And then these are the cream crocs together. Push this in the front. And then this is what they all look like together. Let's see if I can do it see that. I hope this helps you guys see the difference between the white and the cream croc. I feel that with Motrim, they are trying to move forward, trying to have a consistent color batch for each leather. So I remember when I got the pink lychee in pocket and then waited a few months and bought the personal in the pink lychee, the color was just so different. Personal was just like bubblegum pink, while the pocket was more of a dusty rose color. And so I found that it kind of is similar the newer white batch is definitely more bright than the older white lychee, but I feel that these two, since these two are the newest Motrims that I have gotten, would be a best color match to what you would find in the white lychee and the cream croc. That concludes my comparison. Leave down in the comments which one you guys prefer. The old white light chi, the newer white light chi, the new cream croc, or the older cream croc. I'd love to hear what you guys think. I personally love them both. I don't find myself selling any of these. They are so gorgeous just on their own or even together. And if you guys have any other questions, please leave a comment down below. And I will answer them back. If you enjoyed this video and thought this was informative please give it a thumbs up and think about subscribing as well if you hadn't had the chance yet so yeah 
I hope this helped. Until next time, you guys. Bye.